Hey, and thank you for visiting my channel. In this video, I want to talk about exporting images in Photoshop. Although it seems like a very simple subject, many people seem to have uh, problems with it. I'm often being told that someone saved image and the colors do not look right. So how to make sure that the colors look right when we save the image in Photoshop. So I'm going to show you how I always do it to make sure that the colors are right. I'm going to file and I'm not choosing save as. I'm only using save as when I need to save this as PSD file, so as Photoshop file or TIFF file. When I want to save this as JPEG, whether the customer require JPEG or for myself, I'm going through export. And then I'm choosing export as. Also not save for web, that's the old way as I remember. So I'm choosing export as and I will have few options here. So first of all, the format. Um, we don't have many options here. So that will be PNG, JPEG, GIF and going with JPEG, of course. Below, we can choose the size of the image. So we can easily manipulate by the with the scale. So we want the half of the size. We go with the scale 50%. So that's really something very convenient here, especially when I need something, for example, below um, size uh, 2 mega. So uh, I could easily, for example, change the scale here to 30% or lower the quality and change the size of the image. So I make sure that it will be, for example, accepted in the places for the thumbnail, for example, for YouTube. If there is no need, I could keep it at 100%. And what really, what's really important when it comes to the colors is below here, which is named color space. So when we will be saving for the web, uh, we want to convert the image into sRGB. But sometimes when we receive the work in the color space that will be Adobe RGB or Profoto RGB and we save in, if we convert this to sRGB, send it to customer, the colors might be different and the same opposite. So we might save it, but if we get the images from the customer and it's required to keep in the same color space, it's always good to choose embed color profile. So after it's done, just export all, choose the place where you want to save it and hit save. And that's it. That's the best way to save JPEGs in Photoshop.